What up, it's your boy Naftastic, and so we were having to replay a few games because of the crash that happened, and we had to go back as far as the Billericay game, and this time the outcome was 2-1, so it was still a one-goal margin, but we managed to sneak two goals in. Um, uh, moving on to the Wheelstone game, hopefully we we'll get a win here as well, because we're the superior opponent, and we need the confidence, boosting victory ahead of the season um one thing i did notice is that i didn't sign vernon simpson i did in the previous video mainly because i harbor hopes of signing sanchez ming to a longer contract and i didn't think vernon simpson really was good enough to add an extra body into the squad anyway so I'll click through to this match and it was one that was quite disappointing because Wilson had a lot of the uh, the possession, the attacking football, the playing in my half primarily. So I tried to move attacking and tried to hassle them a bit just because with our, in theory, greater quality, we should be able to put pressure on them. But here they come on the attack, down the wing, and a cross comes in and then it's an own goal, but again, the crosses and the corners and the free kicks continue to cause me problems. Anyway, so we'll, we will address that, but for now we need to get back into this game. I, sh I can't be losing to, to Wheelstone. I mean, that's just not acceptable. So we, we try and replicate, push down the wing, and we have the same effect. We score from the cross. So it's 1 1 now and starting to get better. But Wilson are relenting, which <laughs> I don't know whether to be impressed or disappointed. But going to half time at 1 1, we should, and I'll say this match is still ours for the taking. We want this victory. We want it, we need to go get it. So let's go do it. Send the boys out and. Wilson just just are not scared. They they continue to push. I'm hoping we can take advantage of that. Catch them on a break, maybe use the space. But I mean it is still a friendly at the end of the day and I'm still gonna make changes. So try some some fresh legs on, see if they can make a difference. And just <laughs> Wilson continue to attack. So the his his goal kicks have been a problem recently. So straight to them, they put it out wide, cross it in, and it's a goal for them. Two one Wilston. I know it's early, but I'm gonna push attacky again and see if I can get an equaliser. It's gonna be difficult. I mean, especially because I'm trying to make a lot of changes and I'm trying to put a lot of fresh legs on. And there's another goal from a set piece. We're also dominating. Um, I'm quite embarrassed. <laughs> um, my, my team haven't played well today. And this is against weak opposition. It almost, like, we went for a corner there. Didn't do a decent job. St still, still disappointing. And now I've got an injury. Well, after I made a ton of substitutions, I don't think I'm going to get it back in this game. It looks like this is real stones. And fair play to them, they deserve the victory. I've, I've put a few attacks in, but it's just doing nothing of any substance. So I'll say it's unacceptable that we don't win these matches. One player turns off, I mean, they had the majority of possession. I had more shots. I mean, the stats really don't reflect how much they deserve that win, I think. So, we've got another another friendly coming up against Worthing United. Again, another team that we should be beating. And we will have to push on for that. We cannot let... We cannot go into regular season losing against teams that are weaker than us. 
I do think there is promise for this team though. Uh, I feel like that the ranking that the game predicted for us at the start is a bit off. I think we can do a bit better than that. Oh, that's interesting. Chris Smalling signs for Arsenal. I don't think that deal happens at all in real life. <laughs> I just think United need him too much and Arsenal wouldn't sign him for 13.5 million. It'd cost a bit more, I reckon. Just because of his potential. That's on my scout. Not really a fan of his feedback again. So we'll focus back on this friendly against Reading United. Go through. Not sure why it's highlighting this Eddie Aldroyd. Oh, he's one of the strikers. Oh, uh, maybe it's because my mouse is over the top of the player. Yeah. It doesn't look like there's anyone of real note or threat. Um, so I'm just gonna once again make some changes for injuries, fresh legs, etc. Um, try and put as strong a team as I can out there. I mean, there's only two injuries of note. We'll, we'll go into it. We've got Theo Fanos and I can send you up top. So let's hope they can get back in the goals. I mean, they they need a morale boost. And for them especially, confidence makes a whole world of difference for their performance. Again, I'm favourite, as the predictions show. So... Let's actually relish this tag and just go on the attack from the get go. So push on. Nice little passing just to build up the play. I like it when we retain possession. Oh, it's a penalty. It is a penalty. Let's see how we do. Given some of the finishing I've seen in pre season, I'm not 100% confident. They all, but he puts it away. Go on, Theophanus. Great stuff. Great, great stuff. 1 0. And it's quite early on still. So. But let's push on for more goals. They come in the attack, but nothing really of any threat. I continue to push. Oh. They aren't relenting, but they're not really coming close to the target either. So I'm not really afraid of what they're putting together. Oh, that was closer. Good free kick from them. Don't wanna I don't wanna concede this one nil at half time. I wanna build on this lead. So give them a bit of a morale boost, it's still pre season done. And two of the players really liked it. <laughs> one of them being my goalkeeper. And the other being my centre back. Because that really makes a difference to my goals. <laughs> but hopefully it means they defend a bit better. So from the hot goal kick. Uh, sorry. From the centre. <laughs> they put it out wide. But look at that. My defensive training is already having an impact. Which is good to see. And hopefully as the season goes on. I'll get tighter and tighter. And we should have one of the best defences in the league hopefully. But we'll see. Anyway, continuing to get caught offside, which hopefully means that we're trying to get beyond the last man. And we're making chances to do so. Um, at the moment, it, says, it seems like Worthing's having the majority of attacks. Uh, but they haven't scored yet. I don't know if that's a result of good defending or poor finishing, but I'll take it and I will put the credit with my defenders. <laughs> um Still, still passing about a bit better now. Looks like we've dealt with the pressure. Oh, nice little pass there. Theophanus, great pass. Oh, yes. That's Brown with the goal. It's a good finish and a bit of good play as well. It's nice to see. 2-0. That's two minutes of added time. Let's see if we could add a third. Worthing on the attack. Oh, they're forced back. Look at that. Close them down. Got the ball. And that's that. 2-0. Not a bad result, actually. And clean sheet. Couple of goals. Happy with that. And I can say we're proud of the result and the performance to go with it. Absolutely agree. 
It says they had the most shots, but only two on target. So, there you go. So, coming through pre-season quite nicely, actually. We've done quite well against the teams that we should be beating. And put a good showing against the ones that should be thrashing us. I'm just going to make a few changes to our training schedule. Just to help with a few little nuances. And then next time, we'll kick off the regular season. See you then.